Welcome back to Jack and Sifu Wen Chen. Today we will study one case when you are in basketball court, you street fight with other people. How to use Lapta and Pata to solve this problem. Let's go! We will start to study this case. First, they fight together. See that? And then the white pants guy grab the, the strong guy to fool him down and then the other guy try to grab him and fool him but it cannot because too heavy the guy okay going back to watch the detail first they fight together this uh, the strong guy he's doing the right thing football defense but in here I want to point in some little bit he put down the hand the distance is okay, he running around the circle. It's heavier than him, but he is stronger, okay? So, I want to point it here. He put down the hand. You see that another guy put up the hand, he's ready to fight. But you put down the hand, he's not all ready to fight. Especially in uh, forever boxing or martial art, you need to put up your hand to ready. It's not like that. It's the, this is movie, okay? Don't do that. Very stupid to do that. You see, if you don't have the ready and somebody ready, you see this guy to grab him and then throw him down. This is very dangerous, especially somebody learning MMA. Luckily, this guy is not MMA, learning MMA. Because I have experience, I fight to the, try to play with the one MMA Sifu. I learn Wing Chun. I don't know how to grab. When he grab, and throw you down, they will kick your rib, so your rib will breaking down, or they will hold you very tight. You cannot go out. So this is very important in this part. I want to point in this part. Okay, don't put down the hand. Pay attention to your footwork and focus to your enemy. Okay, don't put down your hand. I told him many times this way. He tried to grab this guy again. See, he cannot because it's too heavy. This guy heavier than him, so he can't. That guy is doing the right thing. When this guy going to fight him, and he protect like that, okay, this is totally correct. Okay, protect your face first, and then he defend. You see, he defend and then attack. See that? This is this is the right thing. Okay, defend and then try to hit. They both defend. No problem. Okay, again, keep the distance and then again. Here, I want to point it here. Don't, if you are not kicking, don't try to lift up your leg because between you lift up the leg, that was the weak point, you see? And then the big guy hit, attack, attack him. So very dangerous. Luckily, he defend. Again, here, don't. If uh, you are not kicking, don't try to lift up your leg because very danger in martial art. I try to, I try to grab somebody the leg and then push his, push him down, and then I fight him the everything because if I push your leg, you just only one leg standing very weak. You easy to fall him down. Okay, pointing the, this point very important. This guy. Try to speak to him and then fight. He fight. They both defend, you see? And the guy try to fight him again. His lock doesn't work. He, he try to fight back again. So that, that was where we realized uh, basketball caught fighting, street fight. Because they both know how to fight. See, we, we watch that again. First, they fight and they both defend. Okay, the guy keep the distance running around. But but very stupid is put down the hand. So, and that guy, the big guy is grab him and fold him, fold him down. And then he try to fold the big guy again. It's not that much because it's too heavy. Don't try, okay? Keep the distance. They fight together. And then the guy is very, very smart to protect the face and then attack again. And here, he lifting up, okay? He lifting up the, the leg. It's not doesn't work, so it's very weird. So the big guy is very 
attack him back again. So they keep the distance now and speaking. And then that guy is always protect your face. It's very, very good position. And that guy always put down her hand. So it's very danger. He tried to hit hit this guy. Okay, it's not doesn't work. Because they all protect is very good. Today I will teach you one technique is pata and lapta together. This is combo. When you are in the basketball court, you fight with the people. So another guy is not stable. He's just doing like something like boxing, but he always do this. Is um, if we learn martial art or Wing Chun, we know the basic structure is not stable. So for that time, you just need to protect yourself, hands up, and then moving your step. I teach you this step or this step, okay? Moving, moving, moving. And then when he try to hitting you this for this this punch, because he losing the balance, you just use lapta, okay? Okay? Or the first problem, he, he lift up the hand like that, you just using the pata. It's, it's really well. And that point, don't try to use to like that. that. It's not kicking between the kicking or step. I told you before, I will grab your leg to move you down. Okay, that was very important. Don't do that. Make sure you are stable. This is street fight. It's not um, the, the MMA or something like that. MMA, they have the area. Street fight, you can run in everywhere. You can hit everywhere. So they don't have the rules. So that was very important. Wing Chun is very suitable for the street fight because low rules. Don't grab, don't, don't do like that. Remember, don't do like that. Because I will grab your leg, move you down and then kick you, hit your brain. So that was very important. Today I teach you two techniques. Is lapta and pata. If you like this video, please remember to like or subscribe or share it to your friends. Please comment below. If you would like to learn more Wing Chun, we have more free at our website, learnwingchun.com. Bye, see you next time.